Exciting news out of New Bern today. Coastal Carolina Regional Airport is expanding. It's part of a major terminal expansion plan, which includes several new upgrades for passengers and airlines. Not in your signs. Aaron Jenkins is live at EWN. And Aaron, what are some of these changes that we're going to see soon? Yeah, Ken, Angie, it's a $26 million project that will give a modern look here inside of the airport, as well as improve some amenities such as terminal bridges and baggage claim areas. And it's all in an effort to keep people flying here to New Bern for years to come. If you're flying into EWN, it's soon going to have a new look. The $26 million terminal expansion plan includes some big changes on boarding. The jet boarding bridges. So that means you don't have to walk out in the weather getting on or getting off the airplane. So that's a nice amenity. And also changes to safety. It's increasing the area for the TSA screening area. The current terminal was built prior to 9-11. It will create some efficiencies and safety uh, for that process. With high forecasts of flights for EWN in the coming years, the construction won't interrupt any of their trips. They're building a temporary place for security and boarding gates. We're literally changing the tire on the car while we're driving it. So we still need to be able to facilitate passengers in a safe, secure way. The changes are a big step, not only for the airport. Beyond the pandemic and the pilot shortage and things like that, uh, we expect that having a more capable facility, both in the size of the terminal and we're going to look at expanding the runway as well, will make it more available to more types of air service from different places. But also so for all of Eastern North Carolina. The airport is almost a half a billion dollar annual economic impact. So this is a great facility for the community, whether you fly or not, it's bringing huge impacts to the area. And we just need to stay ahead of the curve to be able to provide these facilities for the communities we serve. All phases of this project are set to be complete in about two years, so in the summer of 2024. Several passengers I spoke with today say it's exciting to hear about the possibilities of travel right here in our area. Live in New Bern, Aaron Jenkins, 9 on your side. Aaron, thank you.